This weekend alone, the Des Moines police issued 1,400 snow ordinance violations. Compare that with last year when police would hand out 2,700 during the entire month. So why did police crack down now? KCCI's Bo Bowman is live to show us why. You can see that there are still some roads out here that aren't completely plowed. And that makes it hard for neighbors to get in and out of their driveway. Cars are here parked for days. Natalie Mendez lives on Wall Avenue on Des Moines South Side. Monday afternoon, there are still cars parked in front of her house and snow all over the street. Everything else could be perfectly clean, but your streets are built with ice, with snow, and you can't even get in or out of your own home. Get your car off your street so we can clean it. Des Moines police say they wrote more than 1,400 snow ordinance violations over the weekend. They say they wrote 2,700 violations over two snowfalls in February 2019. It certainly seems like a lot. You know, we try to do our best to give you as much advance notice as we can that we're going to start our enforcement. The ordinance states all residents have to move their vehicles off the street while the plows are at work. The city says violators cause more snow and ice to be compacted by traffic. Each violation runs a $35 fine and your car can be towed but police say they would only take it to that extreme if a vehicle became a safety hazard. We did have an experience last year with just that where we needed to get a fire truck down the street and it wouldn't fit. Sometimes especially when you're coming home from work and there's already a built up of snow and you're just trying to get into your driveway. Mendez doesn't want her neighbors ticketed, she just wants them to move their car. Just be nice to your neighbors, to your community and just park somewhere else. Some streets in the city do have an even odd side snow policy, but if not, you're supposed to be completely off the street. Live in Des Moines, Bo Bowman, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.